Hi Aquarius, this is a quick love reading. This will go for the month of June, okay? Um, so we've got our Angel Acer cards full. So quick love messages for the Aquarius. We have no need to worry, be assertive in the near future. Uh, we have a timeline, so that's in the near future. Unlikely, yes, and a no answer. All right, so let's go ahead and clarify what this is all about. Um, we're gonna pull one card for each card. Uh, no need to worry, what is this about? No need to worry. Queen of Cups, no need to worry. Um, stay emotionally balanced in regards to a love situation. Be open to receive and to give love. Um, don't be unstable. Excuse me, stay emotionally stable. Don't be unstable. Um, instability can come from when you are allowing too many energies in your your aura in your life um, too many op uh, opinions um, rest in knowing using your own intuition in regards to what you believe um, if you do that then you have no need to worry if you allow a lot of opposing um, argument to come into your you know your life or you you're allowing all of these different energies then of course you, you start to waver too far to the right too far to the left you're not stable you're, you're off kilter there's instability um also um if you are allowing someone to be inconsistent in your energy they come in and out what what will that uh, um that breeds instability also so um the advice here is no need to worry remain emotionally stable okay not taking on the energy of others because you rest in an in inner knowing listening to your own intuition your own mindset about what it is you believe to be true and real even if it's not seen faith right uh be assertive let's see what this is about be assertive what does the aquarius need to be assertive about ace of cups wow be assertive about a new beginning how you come off to others your appearance and your reputation be assertive about yourself and your self appearance and, and how you look on the outside it's um you know a rather shallow fact but you know people do judge you by how you look you know uh, assert yourself in regards to also how you feel in your emotions you can no longer hide behind the emotions or or repress the emotions you're gonna have to uh, speak your emotions which is the hardest thing for an Aquarius we can write all day we probably can write um, how we feel about things all day but for us to actually you know, verbalize our emotions and how we feel is um, very difficult for some um, you know not all but um be assertive in, in what you are trying to start be assertive in knowing that this new love new friendship is a blessing from the heaven for it, it's going to fill you with emotional uh, um fulfillment because you know that you're on the right path here in the near future speak how you feel to someone if you have the opportunity in the near future no card wants to come out okay 
in the near future what is happening okay four of pentacles okay <clears throat> so in the near future there may be this is a love message a status change or there may be more stability in regards to finding title and status in a relationship now we have gotten to a place of being rooted and grounded having a real foundation in the near future wow this looks really good Aquarius uh, you may want to hold on to that um, you want to have a really firm foundation here unlikely what is unlikely for the Aquarius Page of Swords. It's unlikely that someone has matured. That's the first thing I heard. Maybe this is reference to air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It's unlikely that someone has matured or has stopped watching you it's unlikely that someone in their own space has severed ties give me one more card for the page of swords queen of swords it is unlikely This person hasn't matured. Look what they're coming up as a page and then you're the, the queen of swords. You, you're cutting them out. It's unlikely that this is going to, this dynamic is going to change. This is what it is. They're very youthful, very energetic. They may even mean well at times, but this is a person who needs a little bit more time to mature and I think you're still yielding the sword towards this person in regards to maybe you're even speaking that to them you need to grow up you still haven't changed what is this yes answer for the Aquarius what's the yes answer for the Aquarius wow yes judgment is here the past is relinquishing itself the present is here you have to live in the present the here and the now this might be a good opportunity for you to change some element some dynamic of your life it's asking you to look closely a second time around one more card for judgment one more card for you. Yes. And judge. So yes, you will have a second try page of pencils. Someone's coming back with apology. Yes. Someone's coming back saying that they, they have changed. They that their life has changed. They want to change. The page of pentacles talks about I, him me her yes this person wants a second chance it says yes I want a second chance with you it's, it's causing you to look at something presently so that's that what is this no answer What's this no answer? Two cards. No. The Emperor and the Hierophant. 
The four and the five. Someone may be trying to look out for their loved ones. Some someone is in a dynamic where or a marriage where someone is overly dependent on either the Aquarius or the Aquarius is overly dependent on the other person. The four and the five says that you need to go to some type of marriage counselor, some get some expertise advice. Also, the the advice will come from yourself because it's, it's about experience. You know what to do in this particular situation in regards to some long-term uh, relationship, union, institution, marriage you've been in or are in. Um, it's just a big no here. No. Give me one more card. King of Swords. Right, you may have to visit some skilled person, a lawyer, judge. No, some of you might. Wow. No. Dang, all these cards are good. Jeez. Whoa. Whoa, Aquarius. Okay, we have to clarify this over at the other side. This is the Emperor and the Hierophant. The King of Swords. The Ten of Pentacles. The Empress. The Will of Fortune. The Sun. The Nine of Pentacles. The Ace of Pentacles. Oh, for some of you, this is self-employment. says no even though this is a love reading and then the king of pentacles at the bottom of the deck some dynamic some relationship that comes in for you it's also going to bring a lot of wealth this is a the sun talks about um, a beneficial partnership marriage relationship coming in the future The will is turning for you and it's turning in regards to the Ten of Pentacles, something long term, long term goals, some masculine energy comes in for maybe the Aquarius woman who comes up as the Empress. Your luck changes completely in love. Someone views you, someone who is apart from you views you as the quintessential perfect partner when you get the ace and ace of cups and the ace of pentacles together this is the perfect relationship let's go to the other side and see who this person is we're going to use a different deck and we're going to try to drill down and see who or what this person is what they're offering it looks phenomenal. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven great cards in a row. Not one was, oh, well, even the cards under, all good cards. Aquarius, it looks like something very strong, very long term, very dynamic, very 
um, solidifying and love comes in for you that uh, puts you in a place where you feel this is definitely marriage engagement someone wants to change the status with you or give the relationship status and title the emperor and the empress no something about control too Hmm. We're going to drill down on this Aquarius and see what this no is. This Emperor and this Hierophant. Um, thank you, Aquarius. This looks very good for your love messages. Um, know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. If you want to spread just like this, where we'll pull the Angel Answers cards first and we'll clarify. You can go over to the website and book your reading there. The link is below. You can also purchase the extended read. It's always $2.25 to get the extended read. It's also below. Thank you, Aquarius. Take care. And it just looks phenomenal for you. Okay? Bye.